Order is restored for now on UCLA's campus after chaos erupted overnight. The school canceled classes Wednesday in the wake of violent clashes between groups of protesters. The fights began when pro-Israel counter-protesters allegedly attempted to dismantle barricades around a pro-Palestinian encampment on campus. The confrontation came after the encampments were declared illegal Tuesday night. UCLA warned pro-Palestinian protesters they would face consequences if they refused to leave. Typically there was a whole bunch of group of guys that are like, count, like against this encampment and they started to like tear down wood one by one, gates at one by one, start throwing water bottles uh, and uh, umbrellas. The situation escalated quickly with people shoving, kicking and beating each other with sticks some even using pepper spray. It's one of the craziest things in my life, I'll, I'll say that. Like, I've never seen this happen before. I've never seen people, like, get so heated at this moment. And uh, it was really bad, I'll tell you that. Just before 1 a.m. local time, the vice chancellor for UCLA Strategic Communications issued a statement saying, horrific acts of violence occurred at the encampment tonight, and we immediately called law enforcement for mutual aid support. The fire department and medical personnel are on the scene. We are sickened by this senseless violence. More than two hours after her statement, police got the situation under control, sparking questions over whether the campus was prepared for the unrest. Things are not going well, you know. People are like angry at each other. Uh, lots of tensions going on. Um, I just hope things could get resolved. Maybe with some ne uh, negotiations going on or who knows what? Who knows what? Uh, what will happen? But I just hope things get resolved right away. Right away. <laughs> as dawn broke, the scene returned to calm, but classes did not resume as normal. As UCLA officials advised people to steer clear of the impacted area. Meanwhile, in New York City, police disbanded a demonstration at Columbia University. Officers entered a building filled with anti-war protesters, dispersing the crowd. The university requested help from police after physical violence broke out. These incidents come amid a broader movement on college campuses nationwide, with students protesting Israel's war in Gaza. Protesters in the tent encampments are calling for universities to sever ties with Israel or companies supporting Israel, and they've sprung up across the country. Lauren Taylor, Straight Arrow News.